boys and girls cats and squirrels today we're back with the brand new hot hq and all sorts of other new stuff because we are less than a day away until black ops 6 comes out although technically it's like closer to two days but like who cares don't listen to the bs because new zealand time zone is gonna make it so that everyone gets it early right hopefully everyone please let me play early please 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 um but if you enjoy, leave a like, sub, and comment down below. It's much appreciated. It makes you a go. Thanks so much for watching, and let's get into it. So, my shaders are actually preloading. That's pretty cool. Um, Something that didn't happen yesterday was my shaders preloading, because this game's great. Um, Preloaded in MW3, but not in Black Ops 6. Or the COD HQ, rather, should I say. So, hopefully this does also do it for MW3, and not just Black Ops 6. But who knows? I do have MW3 right now because I want to try and finish the battle pass but um as soon as I got like a day I'm not gonna finish it and I'm cooked anyways um back over to Twitter where we got some more replacer stuff really that's about it across the past day it's basically just been past two three days whatever it's just been replacer 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 um the the replacer um uh, let me get a better view replacer cool I don't think you guys can hear this, but that's fine. You guys get the really cool EO6 soundtrack. That's awesome. Um, yeah, there was like a replacer little like, like the whole marketing for this has been actually really cool with the replacer. Hashtag, 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 hashtag. Um, the new interface, launch comms, progression, prestige, blah, blah, blah. Prestige master. I'm just so freaking excited for this game. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. A day. It comes out the 24th at 5 a.m. Central. So, take that as you will in your time zone. But um, that is also if you do the New Zealand time trick. Hey, Xbox. I made you a mnemonic. Um, Xbox Game Pass. Recommended. Get to you all PC. Or not PC. Um, all Black Ops 6. Replace like a pro. Replace. Cat picture. Replace. And this is just kind of random. Then T minus three days until we're back in black out. And back in black. Black out six Xbox Series X. Um. I should actually probably enter this just because. Like, I could actually use an Xbox. But I don't know when it, you know, this happens. Ends at 10, 23, 24. We're at, yeah, at 12 PST. PM PST. Oh, so I'm cooked then? Wait, no, I don't think I'm cooked then. I can do it. Maybe I'll do that. I won't win, but whatever. Replace or replacing gifts. Uh, we got this operator thing happening. Pretty cool. Um, Reload details. Race to Prestige Master. Uh... Well, if you plan to stream, perform your first time login and set up before you are live to protect your entered account information. I already did that, so I'm good. Xbox stuff. Um, I, I, I don't know what this is, really. But basically just COD Pod 2.0, essentially. Um, two days until we're just like this, but really it's one day. I don't, I don't know why they keep saying two days. Everyone's going to be playing tomorrow at 5 a.m., DST. My time. That's that's why I'm saying that. Replacer gives national address. Basically just saying if you vote for me, we get national kick ass in Call of Duty Day on October twenty fifth. And a vote for me earns double XP. Reply below up to three times to earn three double XP tokens available for Call of Duty at launch. Black Ops six Activision ID at Call of Duty. I don't know how to do this. I'll figure it out. <laughs> and that's about it. Pretty much. Um, we get free stuff. Free double XP. And we're just sitting here waiting. Waiting for this thing to open up. Although they have a MW3 store and a Black Ops 6 store already in the Call of Duty HQ. And you can boot up Warzone, Vanguard, Cold War, MW3, MW2, and MW19. 
I actually really like this new UI though. It's like really nice to actually appreciate it. I just wish it was better. And I would just go over to here and say, um, forward leaks. But, but I'm about to get, you know, demacked if I do that. So I didn't do that. Uh, forget that I just did that. Cup, is cup getting traded? Never mind. Sorry. Uh, that that's that's not important i i'm an nfl fan i thought cooper cup just got traded but um never mind we're good we're good we're all set um in terms of the nfl fuck the chiefs bro they just got they just got god uh they just got freaking hopkins why you're selling the titans are selling bro i want to die in game in minecraft in fortnite um and in Black Ops 6, <laughs> let's go. I mean, I'll, I'll quick open up this. I'm tweaking, bro. I think I'm tweaking. The COD log. Here we go. Cool camos. Potentially AI generated stuff that actually I think looks really good. I don't care if it's AI generated or not. If it looks good, I don't really give a frick. Um, level unlocks, blah, 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 Pres prestige, cool, wow, so cool, it's a new operator, it's actually really cool, like, really cool, because as you level up during prestiges, you get more rewards, and by the time you're, the next prestige, you've unlocked all the rewards of the past prestige, and the, you know, instant unlock token thing, which is really cool, the prestige, like, logo looks really good, this permanent unlock, uh, probably just goes on the ASFL right away, right? That's what we're all thinking. Uh, if you got the Vault Edition, it goes on the ASFL right away because you're not gonna need the, um... Not gonna need anything else. Um, all the Prestige icons. They did actually give a, pre uh, Black Ops 4 and Black Ops Cold War, like, Prestige 9 and 10, which I'm really happy about. That they acknowledged the games, actually, when every other game got two, but they got one each. Um, Prestige 1, you get the perk a cola gobble gum pack so you're probably going to be getting um you know stuff for that I, I don't know what this premium only thing is but whatever smg premium only what the frick does this mean um oh oh so the the warzone players don't get it if you don't own the game if you own the game you get it but if not you don't that's perfectly my opinion all these prestige things are cool then there's the prestige master thing that honestly is kind of underwhelming compared to what you get along the way but whatever uh it'll be fun um you get any legacy prestige icon eventually level a thousand is one you can the mastery everything and our percenter calling cards that look really cool zombies looks sick Multiplayer looks eh. Warzone looks eh. I am just a Zombies fan, though, to be fair. So, um, one thing I do want to say is let's hit Control Plus a ton here. Um, and, oh, I got to go up here. Can, I'm not clicking in on my mouse button. Urgh. Everyone's saying that that, or there are some people saying that this right here, this is like ghoul in looking thing in the bottom left of this calling card in the top right. Uh, is like that new quote-unquote ghoul boss. I don't believe it's a thing. I think it's the same boss that's on the right, which is just the amalgamation or whatever, right? That's my opinion. I may be wrong. I'd happily be wrong in this circumstance, but that's what it seems like to me. The uh, um, Call of Duty achievements also got leaked, so now we know some stuff for that, which is interesting. Uh, camos, they all look really good. 100 headshots, essentially, in multiplayer. Multiplayer camos are going to be just so easy to get this year. It's not even funny. They're going to take, like, less than a week for anyone that's truly grinding, I think. Mystic Gold looks like absolute ass, I'm going to be honest. It, it looks like MW19 Gold mixed with Black Ops Cold War Golden Viper. Ugh. Neither of those were particularly good, but maybe it'll look good in the game. Opal just looks like worse diamond, gonna be honest. But then we get Afterlife and Nebula, and they both look so good. 
happy about that. Gold Tiger. I mean, it's Gold Tiger. I believe we've seen this before. It's it's kind of mid. It is a gold camo, though. Uh, King's Ransom looks absolutely atrocious. Catalyst looks pretty good. Kind of like a clean type of thing. And then Abyss looks really good. But all of these, the the weird thing that comes with all this is that the um the like final mastery camo you have to do a challenge for, which I don't know what it is, what it'll be, if it's for every weapon or what. It seems like it'll probably be every weapon, I guess. And but I don't know. It doesn't really matter. We get reticles back, and stat tracking for everything on the ARs, SMGs, everything like that. Every weapon, every score streak, it's super cool. Happy about that. That's about all. Ain't, I mean, unless I refresh and there's something new. That's crazy, bro. Um, yep. No, that's about it. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like, sub, and comment down below. It's much appreciated. It makes you a goat. If you enjoyed, thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. Deuces. Jeez, I gotta get my head out my ass and actually get to the turn off screen.